Hey everybody, Mark Morgan live again here at the finish line of the Cooper River Bridge Run. As our coverage continues, I found another dude who can post me up. I'm glad we're not on the basketball court. Yeah, I'll, I'll look, a Yukon plug, nicely done. So uh, what's your name, man? Neil Mamley from right, Neil, Mount Pleasant. You're from Mount Pleasant. Neil, so have you, ru have you run this race before, number one? Four times, the last time that was before COVID. So okay. this is my first time since COVID. All right, so tell me about it. I, I hear differing opinions about the wind and various things. Yeah. How was it for you? I mean, it was, so I looked at the weather last night just to see and it was like it's a sideways win which I don't know what that means but it wasn't in our face which was nice oh okay that's yeah. good that's good what is, what is your experience with this race and why do you enjoy it oh man I mean the, the community people are traveling in from all over the place and then you know, we get to bop around downtown have a drink celebrate but it's um, it's one of my favorite events of the year for sure I've interviewed so many of you who are barely sweating man <laughs> I mean it was cold I don't know but uh I, I may look calm, but I, you gave me a little time to catch my breath. <laughs> cool. Congratulations, yeah, man. Thanks, Have man. a great Appreciate day. It. Appreciate All it. right, let's get somebody else in here. Hey, man. How, How you doing? You? Good. Good. What's your name? Travis Corson. Where are you from, Travis? Mount Pleasant. All right. Sweet. So have you run this race before? This is my second time running the race. Okay. How would you compare this to the last time? Uh, pretty similar. I think it might have been a little colder today than in the past, but I actually like the wind. It helped cool off. That's why I think a lot of us aren't looking so sweaty out there right now. So good cooling thing, bud. Describe the vibe for me throughout the race with all these runners, man. It's pretty cool, right? Oh, tons of energy. I mean, the starting line this morning was a party. Everyone was just amped up, ready to go, enjoying the beautiful weather here in Charleston and just being glad on the bridge and getting over it. So You don't seem winded at all. Uh, well, that's I admit to catch my breath. I'm glad you interviewed the other guy first because I was I was huffing for a while there. Congratulations, man. Have a great day. Thanks, you too. All right. Hey, hey, how you doing? What's your name? I'm doing fantastic. My name is Wayne Jones. Cool, Wayne. Where are you from? Los Angeles. Oh, wow. So, wait, you traveled here for this race? I ran here. Wow. You ran? No, I didn't. I took an airplane. Come on. <laughs> so, so, what do you think of this race? I think this race is in two parts before the bridge and after the bridge because coming up to the bridge it's cold it's windy i had this trash bag on i was freezing I see that. and then after you come across the top the wind's to your back the sun is out the crowd is supercharged you feel so much better you know not everyone can rock a trash bag well you know it takes a lot of practice don't do this if you haven't practiced so how would you describe your overall experience in the bridge run Coming back again next year, 100%. Awesome. Good to see you, man. Okay, nice chat. All right, there you go. So, Los Angeles, California, there you have it. Our uh, live coverage of the Cooper River Bridge Run will continue after this.